So I'm at the airport and I'm really, really sad leaving my baby. But I cried it out. Me and Dada cried it out. And now we're waiting for our flight. My first stop though is I'm going to surprise my 90 year old grandma. I haven't seen her since before COVID. So I'm really excited about that. I'm so excited, except I'm really sad. All at the same time, it's a lot of emotions. See you in Toronto. We reached, woo! So I have made it to the hotel. I finally checked in. It is 10.30. So right after the plane, I went and I surprised my nine-year-old grandma. And it was literally the best thing ever. I haven't seen her since like 2019 before COVID. So that was amazing. My uncle picked me up and dropped me off here. So that's like a blessing to be like, Toronto's like my home. I have lots of family here and my dad's from here. So it's like super special to be back. I am extremely missing my baby and i don't know how i'm gonna sleep tonight i have to go pump i'm still nursing so that is gonna be a tough two days two days three days two nights but it's all worth it i have two beds literally two beds down here guys I literally blended. I'm going to go shower and relax and get cozy and FaceTime my baby. And I'll see you guys tomorrow at the shoot. Ah. I just wanted to show you guys what a mood I am. I brought all of the pillows in the bed and I'm gonna lay in here and eat some chicken wings that my auntie got me. I'm just filling the void, the no baby void. Good morning, beautiful souls. It is 7.30, it's actually 6.30 in my brain. I did not sleep last night. I, yeah, it was a hard night, but it's fine. It's fine because today is a big day. And I'm so excited about it. I'm gonna go and get a little bit of breakfast and then figure out the Uber situation. I have never Ubered in my life. Yeah, so this should be fun. This should be fun. Ugh, my brain is like... I... I need a coffee so bad. So bad. Dressed for a bit before I put mask in our for as it was. I like it though. It looks so good. Thank you. I don't know. Have you tried this before? Yeah. I know it's like a it's saying bonfire, but it does give it a little bit more of like a texture. So if you put that up, spray it, and then just add that to the Video! Hold on. I gotta do my hair. Your hair is making mine look so bad. <laughs> so I just finished shooting. Oh my god, it went so good. Everyone here is so beautiful and amazing and like just hype you up and take away that nervousness. My outfit was so beautiful. My top was like amazing. I looked at everything and I saw the top 
like it was like it's like sitting like here, like there. I was like, I need to wear that. I need to wear that. Oh, I'm so blessed to be here. It like day one was amazing, and now hopefully we're heading. We're gonna wrap up and then head back to the hotel and get food and relax a little bit. I want to go to the pool. I can't think of anything else. My brain is so like, I haven't slept. I'm tired and I need coffee. Yeah. I can't wait for you guys to see everything. I can't wait. Oh my gosh. I'm so tired, but I'm trying to rally. This is my last day here i go home tomorrow night my flight is at 10 30 and the chatters fan wants to go oh my god in my lazy eye wants to go to david and buster's david and buster's david and david and buster's i don't know but I've never, oh, oh. whatever, I've never been there before, and I'm trying to, I'm trying to pull it together. My makeup looks terrible. It's been literally on, oh, since 8 a.m. this morning, and I am not going to fix it. I was just going to fix it, but... I'm gonna put on some blush and that's it, that's it, that's it. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna go have a nice, fun mom's night out with the Chatters fam. walked all the way to the gas station it is 12 30 because i want fucking chocolate milk and nothing here is open like i'm in oakville fucking ontario which is like right by mississauga nothing is open tim hortons closes at 10 Uber Eats isn't delivering anything over here. Like, I'm pissed. I went and bought from the front desk $4 for a Gatorade and $3 for a cookie. I really want chocolate milk and... So, that sums up my last night here i went to the pool which is why i'm so fucking angry <sighs> and i'm gonna pack because i go home tomorrow i have to bring everything to the shoot and then yeah my flight's at 10 30 i feel like i've said that a million times and i'm gonna go see my cousins before it's really sad that I am only here for literally two days because there's so much people here and so much family that I want to see and I can't. But I, I will be back. I will be back. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. But I'm like living for all of this. I'm tired but like so blessed to be here. And I miss my baby so freaking much. But Dada is doing an amazing. Ooh. 
and Dada is doing an amazing job. An amazing job being a single parent right now. This is their first time that they've ever been left alone like this, really. Yeah, really ever. So it's really important for them. And he is taking things like a champ. I cannot get my mascara off. I don't know what. They probably use like waterproof. I don't even give a fuck. I, I don't. So I will see you guys tomorrow, the last day on the shoot. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I think I've met such amazing people and I feel like I've created bonds with people that will like last a lifetime. I'm so, so grateful for that. Hi, I look crazy. I, I need to talk about the second day. I did not film anything but like behind the scenes content my phone i don't know why like my phone was not charging while i was out there like it wasn't charging anything past 30 percent so my phone was like literally dead like the second day so i didn't want to like waste my battery too much so i just am going to clip together a bunch of behind the scene footage update to the last day um, wrapping up the shoot. Uh, yeah, I'm just getting ready for work right now. Me and my get ready partner. You look crazy. I don't look crazy. This is what he does while you're ready. You do what you gotta do. You do what you gotta do when you need to get ready. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. So... It was such an amazing experience. I hope I get an opportunity like this again. Um, yeah, I have already booked another trip to Toronto and I'm so excited to go back. I haven't, I hadn't been to Toronto since 2019. And I'm just excited to go back and actually like spend time there. Yeah, but like this was like an, an amazing experience and I hope that I get to do something like this again with Chatters. Literally so blessed that I got chose to do this and keep an eye out for June. June is the campaign launch and I literally cannot wait to see how everything came together. It's so amazing. So amazing. Everybody that got picked just was such, so, such amazing people. And I'm excited for them just as much as I'm excited for myself. Yeah. And that's it. So thank you for watching. So uh, thank you for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Oh. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. Yeah, so we're happy. But she put five different colors in it. Play with it. Keep moving around. Like your photo. One there.